it's down to the wire at the regionals. The teams must win to advance to the final competition in St. Louis. In Tennessee, Brian's team is still unable to score. The robot didn't do too well. It achieved well for us being rookies. But their hard work is rewarded. Our next award is the Rookie Inspiration Award. Congratulations, 3675. I didn't expect to get an award. Get out of the way, get out of the way, get out of the way, we got a square. Go forward, go forward, hit it, hit it. Down, down. Meanwhile, in Pennsylvania. Okay, back, mini bot, mini bot. 14 to 3 is set. Fire. Here we go. Mo, first. You have to already have that. We're not taking that penalty. Good job, good job, baby. Good job. But I'm pretty sure we got second and third. Beautiful. Sean's team wins an engineering award. But they don't score enough to advance to St. Louis. I'm kind of disappointed right now, but I'm not, I don't feel too bad because we definitely had a great time. Kevin, we're going over there with us, all right? New Jersey and Tennessee are out. Are you ready? In Arizona, Maria's team is still in. Everything hangs on this last game. secret strategy. All the extra practice time pays off with a victory. Everything that we've been telling the kids and everything the kids have been working for really paid off and they can see it. So that's what winning today means. Starting now, they have one month to practice for the finals. I've sacrificed a lot to be in the, on this team, and I hope that once we win nationals, it'll finally pay off. What do you see when you look up in these stands? I see the same thing you see the future of this country. It is undeniable that those kids in 10 years will be the workforce and the leadership of this country. More than 15,000 students have traveled to this stadium for a shot at the championship. Maria's team, the top seed from Arizona, isn't doing well in the qualifying rounds. Everything was just going really, really bad, and the only thing we had good yesterday was the pizza. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, no. He called the penalty. Did he go into the lane? Go, 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 go. They must win the next match or go home. Stay with them, stay with them. Push that white one, push the white one. Now we're playing defense. Push it, push it, push it, push it. Push it. Compensate. You can do this, Dylan. We lost that one, guys. We're done. Huh? We lost it? Yeah. We got first and second on the mini bot, so we're out. They had a huge experience here. There's a lot of new kids here, and we're going to come back stronger next year. Don't worry about it. You too. Well, I'd like to put everything I'm proud of you guys. Do you feel like you're a winner? Yeah. Our team fought hard. You're tearing up. <laughs> I'm proud of them. You're proud. Congratulations. You've been fun to follow. <laughs> no crying. <laughs> no crying. For Maria and her team, it's time to pack up. team is made up of students from California and Indiana. 
they come from schools in mostly middle-class communities. Regardless of whether we won or lost, our team's a lot stronger as a whole, and I think everybody has matured a lot more, you know, including myself. These kids at the end of one season are permanently changed. What these kids are building is self-respect, self-confidence. What they're building is an understanding that in the real world, being smart is really cool, it's really important, it's really accessible. It can lead them to career options that they never thought about. Yes! And it's all shaped like a robot. The robot is a way to make it fun. <laughs> but these kids walk away and saying, I can do that. There are probably several kids that I will never know, but because of the stuff our team did, they will end up creating a career in engineering, and they wouldn't have done it if they wouldn't have had a chance in the robotics team that we started. Thank you.